All right, I'm getting a lot of questions either uh, via PMs or even directly on some of the posts featuring the uh, uh, garagistic solid mount shifter. Just want to answer a couple of those questions. Uh, the first question is how much slop does it get rid of out of the factory shifter? Uh, currently, I'm in neutral, and uh, that's how much side to side play I have, and then uh, this is how much back to back play I have. Now, all of that play is actually in the transmission itself, not the shifter. Um, you know, there is factory, uh, or there is play in the factory shifter, uh, just from all the bushings, rubber bushings, and all the things like that, uh, including the, uh, shift lever. This shifter has definitely eliminated all of that, but obviously it can't eliminate any slop that's in the transmission itself. Um, any of that play that you see right there, I don't notice it when I'm driving, so to me it's really not a concern. Uh, in regards to some of the adjustments, because obviously it uses, uh, set screws here, and it also uses set screws underneath the car. Haven't had any issues with those uh, moving or getting loose, uh, but I did use uh, a little bit of blue Loctite on those set screws when I installed it, so there shouldn't be any reason for those to come loose. I do have my first track day coming up here in a week, which is what this car is intended for. We're going to see how the shifter performs uh, on the track. Um, it should be good. So far, I've really liked it. Everybody who's driven the car has really enjoyed it. Uh, they do say it takes a little bit of time to get used to, which I can confirm. It is a pretty drastic change over a factory shifter. Uh, but given the price point compared to some of the other options on the market, I thought that, you know, given where this is set at in price, it's far competitive to, to what else is available. Uh, I did go with the long option, as you can see. Reason for that is primarily because it's the least amount of uh, room or space that I have to... Uh, move my hand to get to the shifter uh you know factory shifters all the way down here i don't want to have to reach all the way down i just want to be able to you know bring my hand off the wheel shift go back to the wheel and for that uh intent purpose it's been working really well um also to note when you're installing the shifter you absolutely do need to upgrade your engine and transmission mounts uh, i'm using rev shift 95 durometer which have also worked out really well uh, so so far so good if you have any questions, you know, go ahead and leave it for me, and I'll uh, definitely be sure to answer them for you.